Hey tennis fans, today we'll take an in-depth look at the Wilson ProSev 61-100 BLX. The head size is a nice 100 square inches and has an unstrung weight of 10.1 ounces. The string pattern is 16 by 18 and the power level is low to medium. It comes in at 4 points headlight and 27 and a quarter inches in length. The flex is 65 and the sweep weight is 302. The Wilson ProSev 61-100 BLX was very impressive in multiple ways. Since I enjoyed the 90 and 95, I was expecting the 100 to be too large and really give up control. To my surprise, Wilson found a way to enlarge the head size as well as the sweet spot without sacrificing too much control. It has a very solid, stable feel from the baseline and still allowed me to generate spin. The added length, which is a quarter of an inch longer than the 90 and 95, actually gave extended reach but still held a solid feel. Overall, it felt really good and I was very impressed with the amount of stability it offered. I'd recommend this frame to any player looking for an extended length, lightweight, solid racket that is able to offer both spin and control. Let's see what Rachel thinks about this racket. Thanks Daniel. Two things that stood out for me with the ProStaff 61100 were maneuverability and control. It's a lightweight frame and it seemed to offer low to moderate power, but it was so mobile and quick from the baseline that it made up for the lack of power with a lot of spin and control. You can really get this racket around the ball quickly, and it has a good responsive feel. With a great blend of quickness and control, the 61100 contributes to a consistent game. This racket would be great for someone who likes to hit with heavy spin from the baseline, looking for a lightweight racket that can really whip around the ball. Now let's see what Richard has to say. Thanks Rachel. This has to be one of the most unique pro staff frames I've tried, and that list is rather extensive. Between the 10 ounce weight and the tapered beam, it did not feel like the other pro staff models. The power level was a bit higher than my usual racket, so I had to make an adjustment, but after that, I started to enjoy this racket from the baseline. Even though the weight is lower than what I'm used to, the racket was surprisingly stable and I was able to generate plenty of spin. Even though it is a quarter inch longer than standard, I did not have any issues with the length, and this was a very maneuverable racket at the net. Overall, I was surprised by how generally solid this frame is, with no major weaknesses. If you'd like to demo or purchase this racket, check us out at TennisExpress.com, connect with us on Facebook and Twitter, and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Thanks for watching, and stay tuned for all the latest racket reviews from Tennis Express.